Estimating and rounding are used interchangeably all the time. We say these words to mean many different things. Fortunately, um, for the New York State Math Standards, we have specific processes that we use for both. Let's start with rounding. Rounding um, means to take a result. So we round. What do we round? We round results. We round answers. We round the final products. So results, final product. And what this also usually means is we do not estimate or round until we reach our last number. Let me explain what I mean. Let's say we have the numbers 6.5 plus 5.1. Let's say we're adding these two up. What do we do? Well, what we do in this case is add them first, and we would get 11.6. Okay, 11.6. What do we do now? We round it. How do we round it? The general rule is this, that if you have some number and you look at the tenths place, if this value is 5 or above, you take the number, the whole number, and round it up to the next number. So this would become rounded to 12, and that would be rounding. Notice I didn't round until I reached the very last number, right here. Does this matter if you round at the end? Sometimes. So what's the difference between rounding accurately and estimating? Well, let's look at this example. 4.2 plus 5.4. To round, we add them up and get 9.6, and then we round. We add them first, then round. We leave them alone. Squiggles indicate that we are estimating, excuse me, rounding. And 9.6 becomes 10 because this number is above, is 5 or above. 5, if it was 9.5, that would also be rounded to 10. But what about estimating? Well, estimating we use rounding. And this might confuse you, but let's think about this. When you estimate, you round throughout the entire problem you are solving. Well. And if we take the same exact example, we'll see how we get a different answer. When we rounded this problem, we took each number, left it alone, added them up, and then rounded. But with estimating, we change these numbers right away. We round throughout. So 4.2 becomes 4, because this point 2, this 2, is less than 5. Next we have 5.4. That estimates to just 5. And our answer now is 9. Notice, it's different from when we round it. So sometimes these two processes can give you different answers. We'll be very clear about what we want and when we want it. If you see the word estimate, try to use a process similar to this. If you see the word rounding, use a process similar to this.